Hello everyone, Sean here once again. It is September 23rd, 2023, and we're back in our daily Wordle. Our bonus puzzle today is the Quirtle, and we have spun the wheel. Our new Wordle of Wordle Word of the Week is Fjord, which is gonna be I think is gonna be a, a difficult one, but of course if it does get lucky, it's gonna get very lucky. So Fjord is our word and R and an O. Um let's go with I'm gonna go with Moron, check, check for the double O, find the R. All right, we know where that goes now. So, what next? We still have all the letters from Aegis. I think that'll be a good one. Find out, okay. I do I do have a feeling that we're gonna have another vowel. So things can be blank, A, R, O. What are our options from here? Assuming that's true, it could be something different. But assuming that's true, you'd have the word tarot, which would have a double T. That would be a tricky one. Um, what else? Blank A-R-O. I don't believe there's a spelling of carrot like that. I'm worried about tarot. I think that's what I'm gonna go with. It is a little bit of a waste if that's not the case, or if there's not a T. It is a little bit of a waste. So should we, just in case, because we're already at turn four, let's go with the word uh, butch instead and to get more, aha, it was gonna be a waste if we did that. Um, Get more consonants. I still. So we have C A R O. Carom is out. Carol is still an option. Could we put the C at the end at all? Probably not. Let's go with Carol. There it is. Okay. Fjord got us two of the letters, but I think there was just so many options to get down there. Um, it was. Uh, I guess let's just ask Wordlebot. I don't really have an, my own analysis for it. 76 skill, 48 luck. That feels about right. That does. Uh, Fjord was lucky, indeed. So uh, Fjord is not one of Wordlebot's favorite guesses. 67. I'm actually, it's, I'm actually surprised it's that high. But 70 luck to get two letters, the O and the R, bringing it down to 137. Moron was a wonderful choice. Brought it down to seven remaining words. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Not in the top ten. Probably in the top twenty, twenty-five-ish. Um, brought it down to seven remaining words with just a tad, a tad bit of luck. Aegis uh, was not the best guess, but did bring it down to two with no luck. I think there was a lot of options there that would have brought it down to just one. Unfortunately, I didn't really have that full list ready of what it could be. So, yeah, those words were quite a bit different. There wasn't really a great way to to narrow down exactly what those looked like. So, throw, throb, tarot, carol, uh, and then with uh, some double or triple R's, or a double X for Xerox. Uh, so, yeah, down to just one butch from... Uh, eliminated those so tarot and carol tarot would have gotten us uh good enough i just wasn't sure how many words were left slate and molar we've seen this combo before from uh wordle bot almost getting the anagram there and then putting it into place in the third guess all right fjord fjord was less than a tenth of a percent not surprising there one of the uh, least common guesses uh, Carolyn 3, 28.5, 90.9, so about average for Carol. A couple, uh, couple guesses, Carom was one that I had come up with as well. Uh, we'd already eliminated the M. Uh, so let's go on a qu Quirtle here, and we are going to use Fjord again, hopefully get a little bit more lucky there. Ooh, that is a bit of luck there. I think Aegis is a wonderful follow-up for that, though. So we're gonna have blank E-A-R-D for the first one. That brings us to 
uh, herd and beard. Are those the only two options for that? It looks like it looks like herd and beard are the only things left for for puzzle two. So let's just keep the B and H in mind. We're gonna get those somewhere else as we move through. Let's um, let's look at puzzle. I guess let's go to puzzle four. We've got a lot of information here. I'm gonna go with the word sigma here. I think that's gonna be it. It sure is. We did not get our B or H in there to go back to puzzle one, however. Let's see. I'm gonna go with the word we well, can't be can't be guess. Can it be guessed for puzzle three? It is guessed for puzzle three. And what are we thinking for Puzzle one. I'm going to go with the word baton to move these uh, letters around a bit. We have now guessed RB, so puzzle one is going to be the word herd. And we have an H in uh, puzzle two as well. Where will this H go? So do we have a blank O-A-T-H? Loathe would be the word. There we are. All right. Quick ones today. Three, four, six, and seven. Almost in a row. Except for that missing that five. Three, four, six, and seven on that. Which means we and are moving on to the Daily Sinkowitz. We've already done the challenge this week. And yeah, let's go with Fjord for this as well. Nothing. Not surprised. Aegis. We'll probably get something. We left out the U and Y. It's possible not to. Um, all right. So let's go with... Let's go with the word mince. Move these I and E around. E does go at the end. Not surprising there. So we'll, we'll probably have blank, blank, I, blank, E. And we could always have uh, the, that U come in. I think the Y is now out. But that U could make an appearance. So... Probably something in an L. P, L. B, L. We can go with the word white, actually. Get the H on the board. All right, it is an I-T-E. Uh, it's not a U, so we don't have Unite or Sweet as an option. Ah, but we could have a U if the U was basically there to allow that Q to exist with the word quite. Okay, perfect. M, A, C, and E. What are we thinking here? I think the E would probably go third or fourth. But it's, I don't think it's going to be an E, A. So blank, blank, E, A. It's not cream. So A E A blank E. I think it would be the word camel. Perfect. All right, some good information here. This is gonna be the word gumbo for sure. And puzzle four. Um I think we're going to have a double A. I think we're going to have the word salad. Oh, not quite. Not quite. Oh, it couldn't have been. Couldn't have been salad because the D is not in the final position there. That was a silly mistake. Okay, so S, A. L can only go fourth. 
So D can only go third. S A D L. Sad Lee. Would have gotten that if I had paid attention to uh, the previous D up here instead of salad. Wasn't going to be a double A. But uh, fun ones no less on that. Five, six, seven, and a silly nine. Some fun puzzles today indeed. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. It really does help me a lot. And share this video with anyone you think enjoys these kind of games. That's all for now, and we will see you all in the next one.